everyone, welcome back. Today we're talking about tushies, specifically the little tushy on your newborn baby. Now one of the first parenting decisions that you have to make is how you're going to diaper your baby. There's three general options, disposable diapers, cloth diapers that you can launder at home, and a cloth diaper service. Now my colleague at Baby League, Jenny June, just covered a great cloth diapering episode on her Baby Care Basics show, so be sure to check that out. Today I'm going to focus on disposable diapers and we're going to start with one of the longest standing debates in parenting and that's Pampers versus Huggies. Now every parent that you can talk to has an opinion so I'm going to give you mine. I feel like Huggies are best for the long skinny legs and Pampers tend to be best for a little bit of the chubbier legs. That's just a general rule. I do recommend that you get a pack of both of them so that you have both types of diapers available for you when you get home. Once you figure out what works best for your baby and what's not gonna cause a lot of leaks, you can simply and easily order diapers online or send someone out to the store. Now let's talk about the newborn diapers. I do recommend at this point to go to the premium diapers, the swaddlers and the snugglers diapers. The reason being is that they have a lot of really great features. Now first thing about the newborn diaper is that there's a cutout. This is going to allow your baby's umbilical cord area to dry out and heal. It's not gonna to touch that. You never have to fold the diaper down. I love that. Another feature that I like about the newborn diapers is that they have this yellow line. The yellow line is gonna turn blue when exposed to liquid or poo. This is gonna tell you when you need to change your newborn baby. Now, as your baby gets older, you don't have to change a pee diaper right away. However, when they're newborn babies, because their skin is so delicate and sensitive, you do wanna change that diaper right away, and this is a great system to let you know. Now, after your baby gets to about size two or three diapers, that's when you might wanna check out some other varieties of diapers, maybe the more generic types or the not as premium diapers. That's when you're not gonna have as much of the luxury features, and most diapers are gonna be about the same. Now, one other thing to know is that as your baby starts to sleep a little bit longer and skip one night feeding, babies might start wetting through their diapers. So a great tip is to double diaper your baby. Now you can do that with the same size diaper or you can size up. So you use the normal diaper on the inside and then you size up on the outside and that's gonna prevent leaks and having to do a lot of laundry. Now another option for you are nighttime diapers. And to me, Huggies makes hands down the best nighttime diapers. I absolutely love them. You can use these as your baby gets a little bit older, maybe they're a year, year and a half, and they're sleeping eight, nine, 10 hours at night. These are gonna prevent leaks from happening and they're absolutely fantastic. Now, if you want a great eco-friendly diaper option, the Honest Company makes the most adorable prints on their diapers. What's really cool about their diapers, besides the fact that they're so beautiful and they don't have the traditional baby patterns on them, is that they have a diaper service that sends you a subscription of diapers every single month. So you never have to worry about running out of diapers. Now let's talk wipes. For wipes, I absolutely love the large pack of Huggies that are available at Costco. It costs $19 and the pack is huge. You get five huge refillable packs. And what's so great about them is that you also get a home dispenser system and it's a go dispenser system. This is gonna last you at least a couple of months and it's a great buy parent. Now for changing your baby on the go, I am a huge fan of disposable diaper bags. And you know what? If diaper pails are not your thing, you can honestly use these at home. I know a lot of parents that do. They work out really well. It might not be as eco-friendly, but it might be a better option for you and your lifestyle. Now these are great. Let's say you're changing your baby at a restaurant in a public place and you don't want to deal with any sort of icky smell getting out. What's great about these is you put the diaper in and you can seal off the top. They're very similar to bags that you're going to use for when you're walking your dog, that sort of thing. And two of my favorite options are by Sassy. For $8 you get 200 bags. And another option is by Prince Lionheart called The Knotted. Now this actually comes with a whole travel system. Now this one costs $5 and it has one refill pack in it. And the three pack of refills cost also $5. Both great options. Now for changing your little one on the go. One option that I love is the Skip Hop Deluxe Pronto Bag. It costs $30 and what's great is it has everything you need within one bag. So at the end of a day, you can refill this bag and easily put it in a backpack, in a diaper bag, or just take this with you. Now what's so great is it has a padded changing area that easily wipes clean and can actually be zippered off from the rest of the bag. It can hold three to four diapers depending on the size of the diaper and of course your wipes. 
Now you never want to be stuck anywhere without some diaper rash cream because you never know when a nasty rash is going to spring up. Another mommy must have tip that you always want to have in your diaper bag or changing system is hand sanitizer. And so those are my recommendations for diapers, wipes, disposable diaper bags, and changing your baby on the go. I'll see you on the next episode of Mommy Must Haves.